war as Tunubu is re-elected as ECOWAS chairman. See what he has charged all members to fulfill or will be dismissed. Uh, my people, Tunubu knows how to tackle those who tackles him. He's a very good uh, detector when it comes to going after his offenders. Um, we were told Tunubu was actually, um, he, I, he that he stepped down as his tenure as a course chairman expires, right? Yes, it actually happened. But he got re-elected. But I tell you, it was a tug of war. Let's check the content. This is today's news. In a call to a action, President Bola Ahmed Tunubu urged member states of the ECOWAS Economic Community of West African State ECOWAS to fulfill their financial commitments to the organization. This request was made during the 65th Ordinary Session of the Authority of ECOWAS Heads of State and Government in Abuja, where Tunbu was re-elected as the Chairman of ECOWAS. Tunbu emphasized the importance of financial contributions from member states to enable ECOWAS to effectively address security challenges. In the sub region, the re elections which ensures continuity in leadership was aimed at achieving targets related to security, reconciliation, and development. In his acceptance speech, Tunubu pledged to consolidate democratic values and uphold the interests of the regional body, which we celebrate its 50th anniversary in 2025 he appointed senegal president basarao diome faye and togo president paure esozima nasingbe as special envoy to burkina faso mali and niger republic countries that announced their withdrawal from ECOWAS earlier this year. Tunu highlighted the necessities of substantial financial resources to operationalize the ECOWAS standby force to combat terrorism, banditry, and violent extremism. He recalled on members' nations to honor their financial obligations to meet the expectations and recommendations of ECOWAS Ministers of Defense and Finance. Thank you for listening to today's news. Uh, well, norm, on a norm, that is one the, the major uh, thing that needs to be looked into. That is the financial um, contribution for a smooth running of the ECOWAS. Because if no, no money is left or is kept in the purse or in the treasury of the ECOWAS, when the need to fund a particular uh region comes it's going to be very very challenging and difficult in fact they will be struggling to do that so it is very mandatory but what i am very much concerned about is the re-election of Tunabo. is that how is is that how it's been done did he actually met with that's very did he met the merits 
Did, does he merit it? Did he meet the conditions? You understand? Considering the lapses he actually experienced as a president of Nigeria in the first year, how he struggled. Do you think such a person actually merits to continue as ECOWAS president? Let us look at this properly because before we start taking actions, because this is what is killing Nigerian today. And that is why Nigeria is suffering to the ignorance. Ignorance. All right. Um, it has been said, I will still like to hear from you. And then let me know how you feel and what your own opinion actually is on this matter. Okay. So please don't forget to click on the red subscribe buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos thank you